The EU makes a decision on used digital games and a Saturn Classic is back with an HD re-release. Hi, I'm Jamie Segarra and this is your Press Pause Daily. Digital downloads of games are great, but what if you decide you'd like to sell it? You're out of luck, right? Well, maybe not if you live in Europe. The European Union Court of Justice made a ruling recently in a case between software giant Oracle and a company called Usoft. Usoft is a company that buys and resells software licenses. In the ruling, the court stated that the right of a company's license to distribute a copy of a product ends with the first sale. This means that anyone that purchases a digital software license is free to resell that license in the future. This applies to any end user agreement, no matter if it's in the future or a pre-existing one. The ruling also applies to all versions, whether a digital or store-bought copy. For the moment, this just applies to the EU, but there's no telling if this might make its way over to this side of the world as well. The Saturn was a system that didn't do all that well for Sega. One thing it did do was have quite a few cult favorite games, and one of them is getting the HD re-release treatment. Sega announced yesterday that they would be releasing fan favorite Nights in a Dreams to the PlayStation Network, Xbox Live Arcade, and Windows Digital PC download. The game was originally released 16 years ago this week, and this new HD version will have lots of bells and whistles. It'll feature new HD graphics along with a new 16 by 9 aspect ratio. It'll also have support for leaderboards, trophies, and achievements. For those of you feeling a bit more nostalgic, you can play the game in the original Saturn mode, which features the game with all of the original graphics intact. In a post on their official blog, Sega's Vice President of Digital Business, Chris Olson, said that, We've gotten a lot of requests about this game over the years and are very happy to be able to give both former Saturn owners and new players a chance to play it in its most beautiful form to date this fall. As you heard, the game will come out sometime this fall, though when and for how much has yet to be announced. I have to say, though, that this is pretty sweet and I look forward to getting my hands on it. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you missed any of our past episodes, go to presspause.mevio.com. Don't forget to have a great weekend and come back on Monday. See you then.